It's inside the novice chest. Anything good? Gold ring. We'll take the stones. I'll just drink the potion for fun. Why not? Just some nasty bones up here. <laughs> They're just up here doing this. People were watching. <laughs> what was going on? What are they doing up here? Everybody was watching them. The other vampires were just watching this dude chow down. They were, they were doing a fucking mukbang, yo! <laughs> they were doing a vamp mukbang! They were sitting down there in the pew, while some fucking, like, Nightmaster-ass vampire was up here just, like, sucking these bones dry. Everybody was watching, like, oh, wow, very impressive. <laughs> Turn up the volume a little bit. I want the ASMR tingles. Ooh, I'm getting them. <laughs> When we had last left the last dragonborn, they continued their weird missions at Castle Volklar, where they traveled out and fought more rival vampires, and also went out to plant incriminating evidence upon the bod of Mikael the Bard. Yes, incriminating none other than the Dawnguard, their truest rivals of all, perhaps. Or maybe not. Maybe the vampires were more of a threat to the Volkswagen vampires anyway. I'm not really sure. Anyway, now there was tale of incredible rings that bestowed immense strength to vampirically inclined folk. Yes, rings that held the power of Molagbal. Now it was time for them to head out and get them. This is the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. Welcome back. Shoop. There we go. Also, in between videos, I didn't have a chance to get anything done. Let's see. Let's head on over here. Good, good, good. Let's go... Well, let's rest real quick. Should we do that? Should we just do a quick rest? I, have everything I, I think we ought to. Oh god, oh god, oh god, where do I go? <laughs> okay, we also need to remember to touch the... Way, and I won't tell the goblet. The chalice. Oh gosh, it's quite dark over here by this coffin. Alright. How long do we want to go? How about... 17 hours? That feels right. There we go. Should still be night. Excellent. And then we can go over and do a little quick suck. Get a good thing going. Let's see. Down this way. Cool. Over here. And then... Feed. There we are. Great. Now I'm no longer sexy. Okay. And then, let's head over to, where should we go first? Pine Moon Cave or Broken Limb Camp? Is one of them an exterior location? Oh, one of them is nearby. Oh, wow. Is that the one that had the vampire hunter in it? Hmm. I guess we better not call for Odeving just yet. And where's the other one at? I don't see anything on my screen, like, flashing around. Man, sometimes if we bring it down here like like this, we can see. Oh yeah, here we are. It'll show up on the like periphery. Well, it was somewhere to the to the east, Tomorrowwind. What the fuck? Oh, here it is. Oh, it's a giant camp. Oh, weird. Huh. Okay, sure, we can do that. We can um, fly over to Windhelm too by way of Odeving and accomplish some junk by doing that. In fact, we could even not use Odeving if we really wanted to. Because by the time we're at Pine Moon Cave, you know, how far away is Solitude, really? Yeah. It's totally an option. Okay, let's head on out. Oh, look, everything got desaturated again. For some reason, sleeping there does it. Excuse me, by the way. Jeez. Wild hell drinking water. Just does that. <laughs> All right, let's head over this way, and then we'll hit up that. I think that's the place where we had the vampire hunter. Remember, for one of the creation club little doodads, 
I think it was for more vampire hunting equipment, but I'm, I'm not sure. There we are. Nice water jetty. Cool, cool, cool. Good. Oh, look. Yeah, we can, we can do battle with some creatures out here. And power up our vampirism while we're at it. Awesome. Do the foxes actually contribute to it? I'm not sure if they... <laughs> you know what? I'm not sure if they actually do. Look, there's a crab over there, though. Oh, you know what? I forgot. I forgot to go touch the fucking chalice. <laughs> Hang on. Should we should we go back real quick and do it? Should we go back and touch the chalice real fast? Fuck. I feel like we ought to. We're not that far yet. We can still do it. We can still do it. Hang on. Ah, oh, man. The fucking chalice. All right. Revert form. Why can't I just take it with me? Why, why, why? <laughs> I should just be able to take the, the fucking stupid ass chalice with me. No one else is rubbing the chalice or whatever they do. I don't see anyone else going over there and doing shit with it. It's just me. I'm the only one benefiting from it. I ought to be able to take it with me. We can pour a little out or something in a little, like, solo cup here for the rest of them. <laughs> right? <laughs> Or maybe, maybe it has to be in the chalice in order to hold it, right? Because otherwise they could have just, like, glooped some up from the, uh, what do you call it? The, the source, the fountain of power. There we are. Good. What's it do again? I keep forgetting. Let's see. Magic. What the fuck? Do I actually have it? Blood of the Ancients. Ah, yeah, the it and gives us Magicka Drain. Off. And stamina, but the Magicka is a big one. Okay, let's skedaddle on out of here. Great. Let's use our speedy time boost. It's not gonna hurt us too- yeah. Just a smidge. Alright, travel by way of being a human, and then once more Vamp form. Let's see, there we are. Good. Maybe that crab is still here. I don't think so. Oh, wait, no, it is. Okay. There we are. I've noticed some folks writing in wondering um, why I don't more frequently use my vampire to walk across water. Especially when we're in the overworld. And quite simply, it's because, like, it can be fatal for us, right? Like we saw, case in point, earlier. I'm pretty sure when you go across the water in vamp form, you still get cold. Right? I think it still freezes you. It's either... Like, it felt as if it froze us faster. Maybe, maybe I'm just, like, tripping balls and it didn't actually. But now I'm afraid to do it unless I absolutely need to. Right? It felt like when we flew across, like, the shore here, doing that rapidly progressed our freeziness. And like I said, maybe maybe that wasn't the case. I wonder if what is the case... Okay, how about this? Maybe that's true, maybe that's not. But I bet this is true, at the very least. We freeze up extra quick out here like this, because... Oh, look. The elk actually counted. But, um, I wonder if it's because we are technically fucking naked, right? None of our regular equipment provides its buffs to us when we're in vamp form, right? So what if, when we do it, we're also not getting the equipment bonus of, like, the warmth? Do we get, like, um, the armor rating? I don't think so, do we? I feel like we would be taking way less damage if that were the case. So it may well be that we're technically just running around out here, like, completely fucking naked for real. And no one, no one ever would say, like, oh, weird, you're naked. Because, of course, first they'll say, oh, weird, you're a fucking freaky vampire chicken wing guy. Right? <laughs> they won't say, like, oh, you're, you're naked. <laughs> Gross. No, they're gonna say, wow, you're a fucked up blood-sucking motherfucker. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> There we go. Let's take care of that. 
get a horker. A horker soul. Oh yeah, look at it go sliding. All right, and we need to go into the little area that has the interior, right? The exterior one is for the giant camp, which is like, fuck knows where, like way a million miles away. Cool. <laughs> All right, I, I do like that they go flying like that. I do enjoy that a lot. Maybe it's like, are we priming them by sucking them off? When we're sucking them off, are we like building kinetic potential or are we building potential energy within their bod? So then if Cicero gets like the final blow, they go absolutely flying. Maybe that's what's going on. Look, we're literally freezing right here right now. I can't even check my map because I'm afraid that if I turn into a guy, I'm just going to be really cold. <laughs> I'm afraid it's going to happen. Look, if this is where we- where I think it is, we ought to be fine, right? There was like a fire or brazier or something in there, huh? In fact, I think there's one up here. Here, let's do a quick save. I remember we found like a little secret treasure inside of this tower? Or maybe a different one. I do remember this frosty troll. There we go. Oh. Look out, troll. Stay frosty. And get sucked off. I can't believe our melee attacks don't also do a suck off, you know? I feel like that ought to be the case. Yeah, look at this. Some dead ass folks. That was kind of the fun of being a werewolf though, is like if you already found bodies that were dead, right? You could still benefit from them. It kind of turned like corpses into a resource in a way. You know, it was kind of neat. Which, sure, true enough, they still are if you're, like, a necromancer. You know, if you're, like, an early game necromancer who doesn't yet have, like, permanent junk and all that going on. Okay. How the fuck do we get to this? Is it the cave? Should we just cut across the mountain here? I think we ought to. To be clear, I think we're now at a point where if I turn into a man, I'm 100% dying. <laughs> right? <laughs> I think I am 100% going to fall over dead if I turn into a guy without first, like, warming up my vamp bod. You think vampires would be down with being cold, you know? I feel like in a lot of fiction, they're always cold-blooded. Right? And that's sort of like something they're like, <laughs> Blee! I'm, I love the warm body of non-vamps. Mmm, you're so warm. Your blood is warm. I'm cold. I'm a monster. You know? Blee! They, they're into that. They're like that. <laughs> right? I feel like there's been some sort of shit where like they don't show up on heat vision. You know, like someone has some kind of weird heat vision tactical equipment or whatever to look for vampires. An idiot. <laughs> there we go. I should have had equipment with detect undead on it. Absolute clown shit. Ooh, look at all this. You know what? I'm not gonna pass up another opportunity to suck off a frost troll. There we go. Maybe we even got another perk. Look, there's some like. Who are these folks? Is it the fucking Dawn Guard? Oh, it's Bandit Chief. Okay. Fine. Look, my sucking is powered up now. Amazing. Let's see. Is there another one way over here? Shit, I can't fucking see shit. It's so blue and everything. Okay. Let's transform into non-caster mode. Maybe I can, like, munch on him a bit. Fill up my hunger. Does this fill up my hunger? No, it doesn't! You have to... <laughs> we have to feed on, in, on them in the, like, hungry way. We're feeding on them in the I'm hungry for power way. <laughs> Good lord. Being a vampire is so fucking complicated. 
<laughs> Look, this guy is scared. All right. My supernatural reflexes kick in. Excellent. Yes. Oh shit. Okay, I hate it. There we are. Okay. Okay, this will this will do, I guess. Oh my god. It kind of sucks. <laughs> it's really not that great. <laughs> okay, here. Let's uh let's get our vampiric grip, I guess. Can I pull him? Can I, can I pull him off and then suck him? <laughs> well, okay. There we are. Cool. Good. Fantastic. Surely we got a perk point out of that, huh? Wow, I didn't? Man, we're, we're really getting up there then. I would assume it's like a... The amount of sucking you need to do is roughly equivalent to the amount of munching you have to do as a wolf, right? I assume that these are, like, practically equivalent, you know, with regards to, like, how much of each you gotta do. But maybe not. Maybe it's totally different. Let's see. Will bat form, like, help me get across here quicker? See, I don't know, because there's kind of like a... You pause a little bit after you do it. I'm not sure. Maybe sustained sprinting with our little chicken wings is preferable. We better do a quick save, by the way, in case we, like, encounter something real bad over this way. There we are. Over here. Oh, there's another frost troll. Good lord. I mean, I guess, it, like, it's great, right? Normally, frost trolls, they're all over the place and they're kind of annoying. But now, we actually get something cool from them. They're like a fairly easy target. That's the end of that. Okay, and then over this way, I'm quick saving again. My god, how far out we gotta go for this? I don't remember it being this far. Oh, look, some felled trees. I vaguely remember this area. Uh, right, and I remember talking about how, like, yeah, oh, shit, now this is the Dawn Guard, huh? Yeah. That's cool. Do they regularly show up at locations where you're sent out to? Is this, like, very intentional? Like, they they have intel and they're directly trying to intercept you? You know, if anything, like, I feel like we got a problem where somebody is a fucking mole, <laughs> right? We 100% have someone feeding the Dawn Guard intel. I don't remember if that actually comes up and is real in their quest line, but they have reliably shown up every fucking time. Like, someone is 100% feeding them vital information. There we go. Good. Right. Maybe it's like... <laughs> maybe it's one of the cattle, you know? They're not actually cattle. They're just they're pretending. Or someone someone is a thrall, but they're not actually a thrall. Right, they were right. Because <laughs> of course it wouldn't work if your target is too high level. If, if, if it's like illusion magic, you know? Some like low-level vampire idiot casted like vamp thrall on some high-level dude or whatever. And then they're just running around pretending like they got thralled. But they're out here, like, sending out secret messages to fucking Dawnguard, letting them know what's going on. They're just pretending. Right? <laughs> what the hell? Okay. Here we are. Let's do a quick save. What the hell's even gonna be in here? Whoa. Oh. It's a... Creepy wolf. Okay. It is very warm in here. Was that all of them? Oh yeah, I remember this place! I was looking at one of these cool statues or whatever and it scared me. Oh my gosh. Also, let's claim our prize. While we're at it, before I forget. Do I want the cloud of bats? Will this give me XP if I use it? Will it count as like... 
me sucking someone off? I don't know. I'm gonna get Night Cloak. F it. It's kind of fun. I like the idea of all the bats following me around like... Like that Nolan Batman movie. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> Sorry. Alright. Let's go over this way. Do a quick save. You know, I can't believe that there's... Oh, right. Ooh! You are a vampire! Oh my god, what a scream! Jeez, I feel kind of bad about it. Who's this? Oh shit, a Nightmaster vamp. Good thing I've got my new power. Bunch of little bats flying around me. Yes! I don't know if the bats are actually, like, fighting or anything. Maybe they're just, like, flying into people. And that's what hurts them. You know, the bats are flying around so quickly. It's like birds flying into windows that are too clean. You know? <laughs> they're just, like, they're buffeting all these people around me. They're not actually biting or anything. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Oh my god, I died. Jesus, I was thinking about little bats flying into people. <laughs> Good god. Alright, alright, fine. It is a Nightmaster vampire, to be fair. Yeah, we're vampires. It ain't right. <laughs> we, we got fucked up by some dark magic. Oh shit. Where'd they go? There's one of them. Is the other dude in Viz, or what? A little concerned about this? There. See, if our folks can tank, it might be good. We can suck the Nightmaster Vampire in the distance a bit. You know, I'm just gonna aim at the wall. Hopefully get like a combo blast. Uh-oh. Oh god. You want, huh? No! No, it's not! Bats! Oh, can I blink through them regularly, reliably? Shit me, dude. Shit me, shit me. Oh, shit me! Here we are. Good. Holy shit, we're gonna get this fool. We're gonna get this fool. Yes! You think you stand a chance? I do! I'm with you! You need to chill! I'm I'm one of y'all! Or or were you like cavorting with them? Were you like falling in love? Was this some kind of like Montague? Oh god, what's- what's the other one? I've forgotten. I've just forgotten what the other one is. <laughs> Capulet and Montague situation? <laughs> alright, alright. Good. Are we warm now? We may well be. Cause... We do need to actually go around and like, collect shit. Let's quick save. Good, revert. Okay. Good. We'll chow down on a little salmon. It's inside the novice chest. Anything good? Gold ring. We'll take the stones. I'll just drink the potion for fun. Why not? Just some nasty bones up here. <laughs> They're just up here doing this. People were watching. What was going on? What are they doing up here? Everybody was watching them. The other vampires were just watching this dude chow down. They were, they were doing a fucking mukbang, yo. <laughs> they were doing a vamp mukbang. They were sitting down there in the pew while some fucking like nightmaster ass vampire was up here just like sucking these bones dry. Everybody was watching like, oh wow, very impressive. <laughs> Turn up the volume a little bit. I want the ASMR tingles. Ooh, I'm getting them. <laughs> <laughs> All right, great. <laughs> Fuck me. God. I mean, I don't know what else it could be. 
<laughs> like they got a fucking bowl. They got a bowl in bones here. They were licking them dry. Fuck. <laughs> All right. Good God. Where did where did the bod go? Oh, there we go. All right. I got some vamp dust. I feel good about it. How about this. Is this old ash pile? Oh no, that was from their like necromanced like thrall or whatever. Oh, okay. Sure. Anything else here? Incident at Necrom. Yeah, <laughs> they're about to have another one. Or, wait. Is Incident at Necrom? No. No. I was about to say, maybe we're going to have... Maybe THE incident is going to happen in ESO. No. No. They'll probably heavily reference it or talk about it or whatever, right? Probably. Okay, over here. Got these. The ring of the crudite. While wearing this ring, <laughs> you will receive 100 extra magicka, as well as regenerate magicka faster. Oh. Cool. Oh, it's like three or two rings in one. What is it, like the the rib cage of like a rat or something? <laughs> what? What is it? <laughs> is this part of a human? Oh, these must be the dick bones. These must be the dick bones. <laughs> That's what that is. <laughs> All right. All right, cool. I love it. I love it. Look, they were getting nasty here, too. They were eating fucking people in bed. Fucking George Costanza-ass vampires. <laughs> okay. Cool. Great. They were, like, seducing someone and having, like, like, naughty vampire horny sex or whatever. But they were kind of hungry. They did, they did the Costanza shit. They, like, looked over and pulled, like, a sleeping person out of their drawer, someone who was like cattled out of a drawer next to their bed. So while they're banging whoever, right, while they're doing their their vampiric like sex bangs, they were they were sucking someone off, right? <laughs> Good God. What a wild time for these vampires. <laughs> what a den of iniquity. It looks way creepier out here, but in reality it's just a horny place, you know? <laughs> okay, let's pop a quick save. Do I want that that ability? I don't know. What do I gotta drop? This one, which increases my magicka resist. But it doesn't affect me when I'm a vamp, does it? Which is why I take so much magic damage, huh? Eh, let's see how it goes. Let's see how it goes. Let's look up the crudite. There we are. Okay, sure. We'll see how we'll see how it works. Maybe it'll be good. Is the other one like a stamina equivalent or something? I have no clue. Okay. Should we just run over to solitude? I kind of feel like we ought to, but I don't know. Like it's really not that far. Because we only even- we don't even actually need to go to Solitude, it's the- the farm here, the stables. Because the carriage lord is right over there. Shit, we could even go to the, um... Not the carriage lord, but the... The boat lord. And boat away over to Windhelm. There we are. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know if- I don't know if the wild ass fucking, like... Super motor just got picked up on the mic, but there it is. <laughs> there you go. Have fun with that one. <laughs> All right. Fucking A. Just rolling out here. <laughs> cool. I love it. All right. Let's see. How do we want to do this? Just, just head on over. We probably shouldn't be in vamp form because we're gonna reach it before we know it. And there may also be like peaceful dudes along the road who we don't want to aggro and then we'll have like a real kerfuffle trying to unvamp in front of them and all that 
Let's see, up this way. Good. Hey, way back in the day, I know they that they've uh, folks have written in that they togged them off the vampire attacks on towns because they were like too, they were too powerful. <laughs> Which, fair enough, they 100% did seem to be the case, especially if you were a newer character and you couldn't yet like wipe out a cadre of powerful vampires attacking a town before they like killed someone you liked. You know? Oh, look, who is this? Is this a Thalmore? No, it's it's some farmers or something, huh? Yeah. It happened so fast. Okay. What? Did you see no. where I went? No. Okay. Here's five Quatlus. Have a good one. Thank you. Uh huh. Be careful and stay safe. Yeah, careful on these roads. I've heard that vampires frequent them. <laughs> it's me. I'm the vampire. <laughs> okay. Who is this? Oh, is this the Azurin pilgrimer? Faldris. Yeah. On pilgrimage to the shrine of Azura. Dude is so fucking lost. <laughs> He's never gonna make it. He's never gonna make it. <laughs> Good God. Okay. God, you know what? Holy shit. I don't remember what I was talking about earlier, but this is way more important. Whatever it was, whatever I was joking about, like <laughs> vampires sucking people up, who gives a shit now? Faldris. Oh my God. Put his ass in Elder Scrolls 6 as a fucking gag character and have him be like, I'm looking for the fucking statue or shrine of Azura. Like, he got so fucking lost, he never found it in this game. He wanders all the way into another province. This shit writes itself. Oh my god, it's such a great niche joke for people who've played the shit out of Skyrim. Put it in. Put it in! Oh my god, it will be so amazing. Folks will love it. It'll have its own little fun entry on UESP. Someone will like be like tweet out a fun fact. Did you know in Elder Scrolls 6, there's an NPC who got so fucking lost in Skyrim? <laughs> I guess he didn't have his quest markers on. <laughs> ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck yes! I love it! I, I live for stupid shit like that. I love it! I fucking love it! Alright. Let's see. Need a ride? Let's Where travel on go? out of here. Let's go to Windhelm. Climb and back and we'll be off. Alright, great. We are a little chilly, but I'm sure it's gonna be a-okay. Clear skies. And smooth... carriaging. <laughs> and look, the Dawn Guard have powerful armor that gives them added something against vampires. Okay, good. We also should do our quick thieves guild job here before I forget. Right? We've got a numbers job. Oh, it's at the stables. Oh. Okay. Let's pop a quick save. I think we have a key for this, but no, we don't. Oh dear. Am I too cold to fucking pick it? <laughs> Am I too cold? I can't pick the fucking novice lock? Oh my god, am I getting survival moded? Here. Let's try this. Is this not gonna work either? <laughs> I'm too fucking cold to pick it. Oh my gosh. Is this even on? Is this shit on? It is. Am I warming up? No. Fucking A. How's a vampire supposed to go in and like suck somebody off in the dead of night? Can't even pick open the damn door. <laughs> Look, I'm getting hungry, too. I'm getting hungry as hell. I'm so hungry, I'm sexy now. <laughs> okay. Good God. <laughs> okay, here we go. Surely this will warm us up. Oh, yeah, nice. Yeah, let's get cooking, baby. What time of day is it? 2.44? That's fine. There we are. 
Yeah, we'll just heat up here, warm up. Looking good, looking great. Excellent, and then we'll run over there, sneak in. We can even do a quick feeding. Right? Fix, cook the books, and have a quick suck. Sounds great. Are we fully warmed up, or do we have like a smidgen more? I think we have a smidgen. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Cool. Let's head over here. And then... Do our little secret crouch. Great. Easy does it. Alright. Oh, there's two of them here. Snoozing and losing. Okay, let's pop a quick save. Oh my gosh! Oh, it's her. Oh, fuck. How do we wake him up? Come on, I thought I was sneakier than this. You're not supposed to be here. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, I got a, I got a tiny bounty. Oh my gosh, <laughs> they got so pissed. Whoa, hang on, hang on. Thank you. Damn, where's she going? <laughs> Where is she going to? <laughs> okay, fine. We can't feed on people who are awake, right? No, I don't think so. I mean, I can feed on them by way of like taking an apple pie. Do you have any idea how dull voices are? Okay, she's going back in there to sleep. How did we get revealed? <laughs> I thought we were doing all right. We've got like a hundo sneak. Maybe it's because we're tired. Is our sneaking diminished from that? He says to the man, or because we're hungry? That's my wife. <laughs> okay, let's try it again. This time without stealing, we're just going to immediately do a quick suck. Okay. Not supposed to be oh shit, they're here. still up. Oh my gosh, he's melded with the I'm bed. Okay, okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh god. Okay, hang on. Let's, let's go into town. <laughs> let's get someone in town. Right? Let's get somebody in town. I need oh, for fuck's stop. sake! <laughs> I didn't even finish! How do you know I'm not doing something else? I could have been, like, clearing my throat. Alright, it won't happen again. Glad we straightened all, all I did was... Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> right? What if I was trying to do some, like, singing, you know? Some, like, throat singing or whatever. Good God. <laughs> what if I'm, like, out here burping or something? I mean, sure, I'm really hungry, but what if I'm burping nonetheless? You don't know. I didn't even... <laughs> Fucking... This town has gone to hell since the Imperials took over, huh? Respect old what's butt that we all know and love. But the Imperial guards... Bunch of dicks. <laughs> okay. Can we sneak in here? God, I don't know if we can. Oh, there we go. Thank goodness. Alright. You're not supposed to be here. Yo, does nobody in Windhelm sleep? Does nobody here sleep? Everybody is up waiting at the door for me to come in. What the fuck? How about the white file? Look, it's not even locked. Does what's-his-name even sleep here? Oh god, he may not. He's awake! It's 3.57 in the fucking morning, dude! What the fuck? How's a vampire supposed to suck somebody off in the middle of the night if everybody's, like, awake? Jerking it or something. What the hell? <laughs> What's going on? All right. What's another place we can check? What's somewhere else? I don't even know. Fucking all their vendor lords are out here. Can we go to like somebody's house over here? Jeez, I'm getting so hungry. <laughs> okay. I'm a sailor on the north wing. We're laying over, over this way. What's his name is dead. Aretino is like nobody's there. How about Naranya's house? Okay, she's our thieves guild contact, right? 
God, she might be awake. Really? The Thieves Guild contact is the one who's asleep at night? You gotta be shitting me. Alright, quick saving. Oh, come on! <laughs> How's everybody so good at detecting me? God, I should've just ate a fucking apple pie or something. Do I really have, like, a sneak debuff? Yeah, I, I do. <laughs> I 100% do. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> Alright, Naranya, I'm... Yeah, I'm leaving, I'm leaving, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Let's just... Let's eat some apple pie, I guess. What kind of a fucking vampire am I? Reduced to eating apple pies off of <laughs> stolen apple pies as if some old lady baked it and put it on her fucking windowsill <laughs> and like some kind of ridiculous cartoon character like the little steamy smoke ar aromatic smell wafts up into my nose and I like tiptoe over, be I'm like being held by my nose by the smell of the apple pie, I tiptoe over and I start to feast. <laughs> what the hell? Okay. Let's head on over here. We're never gonna max out our vampire powers. <laughs> it's a shame that you can't even do it that way, you know? It's a shame that that doesn't give you progress. Right? It's only doing it in combat, which fair enough because you're advancing combat skills. But it'd be cool if like, I don't know, sucking folks off that way also gave you progress, but it had to be a unique person every time. How cool would that be? I feel like that'd be pretty cool. Alright, should we vamp out over here or what? I feel like we ought to, but maybe not. Okay, you know what? Let's do it. I am quite sleepy, though. You think we just leave, like, meat or a pool of blood everywhere we do that? I mean, it's enough to splash onto the camera, right? <laughs> do you think they'll do the camera splash stuff in, uh, Elder Scrolls Six or even Starfield? I feel like they will, right? I feel like it's a staple of modern first-person games to have a little bit of the red jelly jam showing up. Okay. My god, we fucked around so long trying to get stuff that it's already daytime again. Alright, let's see. Can we do some of this? Oh yeah, this is effective. Here, does Vampiric Grip work against a giant? Let's find out. Yo, hell yes it does! <gasps> Fucking A. I love it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. My shit's coming back so slow because of, uh, everything going on. Okay. I'm going melee mode. It's ill-advised. Or maybe it's just what the doctor ordered. There we are. Had to be done. Ooh, this is really bad. Yeah, none of our shit's coming back. I thought maybe our our ring would override the ill effects, the drawbacks, but it definitely has not. <laughs> right? If if it can't do that for me, what can it do? All right, let's hit a quick save. I forget. Did we kill everybody at this mill? Are they still alive? Oh, look at this fucking bear over here screaming at us. I'm not even gonna try and kill it unless it like gives us cause to, because, you know, we're, we can't even do a suck-off right now. What fun is that? Alright. Good. Hey, maybe we can take refuge, though, at the mill. You know, maybe we can do that. Yeah, let's revert form. Maybe we can sleep here during the day, and then we'll be a powered-up vampire for our, like, weird exploits. Alright. Excellent. Good. Oh look, I'm I'm like my stam isn't even coming back either. Is it because of my my weird weapon glitch or whatever? No, it's just, I'm I'm just fucked. 
<laughs> I'm just fucked, is, is all it is. Okay, good. Alright, hey, if we end the video here, <laughs> you know, we can do fishing in between videos, I guess. <laughs> we have that to look forward to. Alright, worker's house. Are they dead? Oh, thank God, I think they're all dead. Okay, right, this is the one that's, like, going derelict, isn't it? Okay. Let's go for 15 hours. Seems right to me. There we are. Good. Okay. And then let's eat a horker loaf. It's kind of heavy. Anything in the barrel? We could use some more salt for later, couldn't we? What? Oh, yeah. Mother? <sighs> Is that your voice I hear? Hmm. All right, anything there? No, just my head playing tricks. Oh. God, the more we hang out with Cicero, the more I start to hate him. <laughs> it's because he talks so much. <laughs> right? He says so much, and it's it's a lot of the same stuff. Okay. The more I wish we murdered the hell out of him during that quest, Arca. Huh? Oh, damn, you're out here. <laughs> she didn't even mind that I went in there to sleep. Fair enough, I guess. Okay. Let's make sure we leave the premises before we vamp out. There we go. <laughs> Listen, what's up with this? What's going on with this? The skill doing this is literally called Vampire Lord, right? And yet I, ver I feel like I very infrequently I do say it sometimes, but I very infrequently call it Vampire Lord or Vamp Lord. Even though I'm calling shit Lord all the time. Everything is a fucking Lord with me un until it is, until it actually is. <laughs> all right, fuck. We got like a pissed off dragon now. Oh, it just zooshed out of existence. The dragon broke. Damn, it really did. Okay, well, gonna, gonna start getting meaty. Uh-oh, it came back. Just see this. Okay, that's fine. All right. Maybe it ain't gonna fuck with us. God, that would be so nice. We're gonna detect some creatures. Could have sworn I saw some. There's a giant over there. Okay. Good. Pop a quick save. Alright. Start blasting. Hell yeah. Uh oh. Good. Oh, this one has the ring or whatever that we want. Or is it an amulet? There we are. Yeah, jump down those rocks. <laughs> yeah, you, you can't do it. You gotta go around the long way. Ho! Oh! Okay, just I just got a little stagger. It's fine. Go. Awesome. See <laughs> that uh the dragon still is not fucked off. It's actively screaming. Oh, not at me though! At the giant. Excellent. What happens if we try to suck off a, a dragon? Can we actually do that? Oh, shit. Getting blasted. Oh, Jesus, and it's sucking up my juice. Oh, I'm gonna quick save just in case. Look, a kill stole me. 
Oh, I can't do anything. I've been rendered a complete baby. There we go. Now I can do a little blasting. Is it terrorizing what's her butt at the mill? No, it's terrorizing Vincent Van Gogh. I can't use a vampiric grip on a dragon, can I? <laughs> I have to assume they're immune to everything, right? Hang on. Hang on. <laughs> ah! I rip it out of the sky! Fuck, could you imagine how cool that would be? There we are. Man, these ones are the worst. Okay, okay. Oh dear. Oh my gosh! Right, magic damage annihilates me because I'm- <laughs> I don't have my- my fun rings or anything applying their bonuses. Okay, okay, oh my god, I'm- I'm immediately transforming. Okay. Hopefully this dragon doesn't go around talking to people. Tell them my dark secret. <laughs> okay. There we go. Could you imagine if dragons could, like, report crimes and shit? <laughs> Ugh. It's gonna s see, this is why we don't want friendly dragons in Elder Scrolls 6. We don't want that. Alright. Let's do some of this. Pop a quick save. We can also make our way over a bit to our, um... Our quest item. Once this creature, like, pauses, I'm gonna... Oh my gosh, actually, I'm gonna hit it with a bend will. Oh my gosh, I completely forgot. Yeah, great idea. Okay, perfect. Ring of the Beast. While wearing this ring, you will receive 100 extra health, and your claw attacks will do an additional 20 damage. Yo! Oh, oops. Okay. That seems a lot better for me. There we are. Oh, my other ring got unequipped. Okay, and then let's get of the beast. Oh look, yeah. Somehow we had two rings equipped. How did we do that? Okay. Quick saving. Perfect. And we can still do fishing anyway because there's, um, there's a little place we can do it back at Volkswagen Castle. Alright. Up and away. There we are. Man, it worked out great. Almost completely forgot that, yeah, we can fly on dragons. <laughs> I got so... I got too invested in the vamp life. Alright. Well... Hang on, let's go to the jetty, actually. Because I'm worried that, like... I'll go to the castle, and then the vampire, or the... The dragon will revert back. I will look for a spot to land. Rather than fly away. Okay, here we are. Yeah, just put me in the freezing cold water. Just- just fuck me up. Just kill me. <laughs> okay. Shit. I really have to go through it, don't I? Let's get our ancestor's wrath. Sort that by name again. That way it's easier. Okay. Good. And then we'll just haul ass over here. Good, good, good. And the jetty is right up, yeah, right up there. Excellent. Alright, cool. Well, when next we come back, I think we will continue on doing more vampire quests, right? Don't we have at least... I don't remember all the radiant quests and stuff. Like, someone wrote in with, like, a pretty comprehensive list of what to roughly expect without spoiling anything. But I've completely forgotten. Just 
like I immediately locked onto the idea that like, oh cool, we're gonna get rings. <laughs> right, that was fun. So maybe we'll do a few more. We'll see what we can do. Oh look, all of our efforts were for naught. But uh, we'll do some of that business. We'll see how many more we, we ought to do. Maybe I'll even check on UESP. See how many we got, or I'll refer to that older comment and whatnot. Could do. And then afterwards, we'll get started again with the main vamp arc, right? We'll keep going with all of our fantastic adventures with Serana. Until next time, please take care of each other.